Have you ever wondered if you can walk or jog you can charge your mobile phone or placing rolling balls on the sea could power your city with the growing requirement of electronics it is of great importance to investigate clean and portable energy sources our surrounding environment has an abundance of energies including mechanical energy wind power solar energy thermal energy chemical energies etc which can be collected and exploited Researchers have developed various self-sufficient power sources by scavenging various forms of energy sources from the environment. However, conventional technologies could not reach the requirement of high efficiency and sustainable capability. Therefore, it is necessary to develop new energy harvesters for solving the power source issues of future functional electronics. Now, let's go back into its accidental discovery. Yeah, when a PhD student was conducting research unrelated to these tiny generators using an atomic force microscope which provides atomic level images using a tiny cantilever to feel an object just like running your finger over an object he forgot to press a button to apply electricity to the sample but he still saw a current coming from the material and didn't know why one theory was that it was a technical problem or interference he eventually pinned the cause on friction from the microscope probe on the material like shuffling across a carpet then touching someone or giving them a shock so it turns out that the mechanical energy of the microscope's cantilever moving across the surface can generate a flow of electricity instead of releasing the energy in one burst uh, they generated a steady current so other researchers are trying to generate power at the prototype stage but performance is limited by the current density they are getting in that is the problem uh, they are aiming to solve so far what others have been able to do is to generate very high voltages but not the current uh, some scientists have discovered a new way to get continuous flow of high current The discovery means that nano generators have the potential to harvest power electrical devices uh, based on nano scale movement and vibration example an engine traffic on a roadway or even a heartbeat this could lead to technology with applications in everything from sensor to monitor structures such as bridges or pipelines engine performance or even wearable electronics so the scientists believe that applications are only limited uh, by imaginations the direct conversion of mechanical energy into electricity by nano material based devices offers potential for green energy harvesting a conventional triboelectric generator converts frictional energy into electricity by producing ac triboelectricity however this approach is limited by low current density and the need for rectification Now let's look into the applications of triboelectric nano generators. Number one, launch structure triboelectric nano generators for scavenging sweeping wind energy on rooftops. A novel triboelectric nano generator is designed based on flexible and transparent vertical strips for environmental wind energy harvesting. Given the low cost, simple structure, and wide uh, applicability, the TNGs present a green alternative to traditional methods used for large scale wind energy harvesting. The second one is the TNG is made into a wooden floor as a switch sensor the mechanical energy of people walking can be harvested and converted into electrical energy and it does not uh, require external power so there is no need for a light switch it can efficiently avoid the problem that the lightning time is longer than the actual time and effectively save energy the third Is it is possible to design a triboelectric nano generator integrated on the glass spray, which detects tiny blinking motions and converts it into a voltage signal, which is applied to two real-time mechanical man-machine interface, smart ohm control system, and wireless ANS uh, free typing system. Number four is when TNG is installed under the carpet at the door. or on the door handle it can play when someone breaks in the role of security warning and move over um, it can made into a matrix installed under the floor according to the location of the electrical signal to locate the outsider 
the position of the outsider on the floor can also pass the information to through uh, bluetooth wi-fi etc wireless transmission mode transmitted to the monitoring camera control system to enable the camera the tracking and positioning of the case is helpful to the investigation of the case and the collection of evidence here we look into the fifth the acceleration sensor based on the tribal electric nano generator can be placed on the sole of a shoe to effectively record the frequency and acceleration of people running the sixth one a special material is used to form teng on the clothes and then an electrical signal is generated through the friction of the body's activity to provide energy for the heating system of the clothes the teng on clothes can also be used as an energy collector to absorb static electricity on clothes and reduce the phenomenon of static electricity on clothes and the seventh one the teng can also be integrated in smart gloves to achieve gesture sensor, sensing so when the finger is bent or straightened the contact area of the skin and the teng will change and the real time voltage will change accordingly so as to realize the induction of uh, different gestures the eighth one the teng structure is attached to the insole and generates an electrical signal when walking on the other hand uh, it acts as a Uh, energy conversion device to collect energy on the other hand it can directly sterilize the insole you know what there exists a large amount of renewable energy in the ocean unfortunately most resources are unutilized there comes a technology uh, where rolling tribal electric nano generator based on nano microstructured polytetrafluoroethylene films can increase the effective contact area and enhance the tribal electric effect which is beneficial to improve the output performance so this teng can effectively harvest water wave energy with various amplitudes and frequency which has the potential to harvest ocean energy for environmental monitoring last but not the least how do you make a pacemaker last them twice longer right we uh, used to breathe a small rat Breathe three times, says the scientist. Can draw a simulate pacemaker once. So this little tiny animal, the breathing can power pacemaker. So this is the energy they are talking about, and they can also implant this in the medical uh, field, and they can drive any general electricity from physical motions and drive medical devices, and this has a lot of potential for many different things. Say let us do exercise every day. when we do exercise within the morning a lot of things are heart beating our behaviors our blood pressures uh, how many steps etc we view the system so the scientist uses this motion and this motion can power a power, power a pad and can send a signal wirelessly to some distance so it is purely based on a motion of human so let us know what's the challenge here the challenge is uh our motion is random you can either walk faster or slower or you can stand converting this random energy into electricity is a tough task so they use uh, the technology of tribal election energy rate then through a power management system and store into a battery and they can use for whatever purpose they want so this is the emerging technology behind tribal electric nano generators and i hope this can revolutionize the world in the upcoming years